James Munn is James, the wine guy. In this video, I'm going to talk about not just a specific wine, just about, uh, you know, taking time and what you do. Stay tuned for this video. So in 2014, I really, uh, you know, made some, uh, I'd say, strides in producing videos that are not just on reviews of wines, and maybe even subject matters that are not, that are not just on uh, wine history or wine knowledge or wine subject matter in general, but really to delve into other subject matters as it relates to wine or as it relates to producing wine videos. And I think that's important to do because, uh, you know, the subject matter on this is taking time in what you do. And when you do that, I think it's producing quality, it's looking towards making a quality product, whatever it is. You may be doing wine, you may be doing, uh, you know, making uh, software or code uh, for applications, or you could be doing a variety of other things. And ultimately, it, uh, you know, you have to look at what I've done in the past, uh, 2014, and it was a great year, but it was also a year where I felt it was just a banana peel. And in doing so, uh, you know, I did a lot of things, but, uh, you know, I also had to, you know, spend a lot of time to get to the quality I wanted to produce a product, a video, for example. And uh, that took a lot more time than I expected. So in producing videos, it's, uh, you know, you can produce a lot of videos, which I did produce a lot of videos, but I had to go back and really not release them on the times that I wanted to produce them. A long time ago, in a video world, long, long ago, I would produce videos and I would do so in one shooting. But in order to get there, what I had to do was do it in one take. So in order to do one take, I had to do it over and over and over again. And, uh, you know, I thought it was saving time, but it really wasn't. And uh, I really think it's a culmination of things. That is, you know, having a new way of producing videos. Also taking what I've done and learned from it. Also taking a sense of uh, a confidence. And also in the confidence that you do, it really comes out in the product that you produce. And I think for me, that's really, you know, for me, I can see that myself. And uh, that's not to say I'm superior at it or good at it. Uh, I think it's just really acknowledging those steps you make because sometimes the only person to acknowledge what you do and you do well is yourself. There's nothing wrong with acknowledging yourself. In fact, that's what you should be doing. That's what I should be doing. So it's also when you take time to do what is right, taking time to do a quality job, and that's the, the, the perfect word here, which is quality. Uh, but it also doesn't mean that, you know, quality has such a dry uh, sense or characteristic or maybe an overly uh, strident characteristic, but it's also to, you know, take some time out to enjoy what you're doing, but also to take time and uh, produce something that's really good that you'll enjoy seeing again and again. So take your time when you're doing an endeavor and making sure it is the right thing for you. So thank you so much for watching me today. Stay tuned for more. I really appreciate your support. I appreciate you watching. So list your comments down below. I'd like to know what you do well and how did you get there? What were the techniques you utilized? I'd love to know. I learned from your comments as well. So thank you again for watching me today. Stay tuned for more. And, and let's connect on a variety of social media such as Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Pinterest, LinkedIn, as well as Instagram and WordPress. Thank you again for watching me today. Stay tuned for more. Salud.